Thanks for joining us on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Let's talk Wilkes-Barre, Scranton, Penguins hockey. A sign, Patrick McGrath, uh, be getting ready to get in camp uh, pretty darn soon. Oh, Patrick, you're back with the Penguins. Uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, being back in Wilkes-Barre, Scranton, uh, kind of your hometown here. Yeah, I'm really excited about it. Um, it's good. This is my third camp. Uh, I was there the following uh, past two years, and it took a a lot away from uh, those last two years, and I was in Wheeling the last two years, and I'm really excited to get things going here this year. Well, tell us about Wheeling the last couple of years, how things went for you there. Uh, I had uh, first year was uh, tough getting used to uh, the professional level, and I thought I came back the second year uh, a lot better. I learned a lot from the first year, and it ended up I got I got to come up here and play two games, so I thought that was really good for carrying over this year. Patrick, take us back to uh, some of the younger days when you first started playing hockey with some of your friends, and now here you are as a professional. Uh, tell us about uh, that that growth, how it went. Yeah, we uh, started playing actually. If my brother asked me to come play uh, up at the ice box back then, they, uh, it was just an in-house league. That's all they really had, and asked me to play and I was like yeah I guess I'll play I didn't really I wasn't sure I was kind of afraid because they were it was uh they were older kids but ended up playing and I haven't stopped since how about some of your experiences uh, that you've had uh, up in the Quebec Major Junior League Hockey yeah it was a really good uh time for me with hockey uh it definitely helped me a lot playing up there a lot of the best players in the world come from there and uh i played two years there and i played actually played half a year in the junior a uh league up there but that definitely helped uh move me forward into now talk with patrick mcgrath the uh, sign with the wilkesbury scranton penguins and mike sullivan uh, is going to be the new head coach uh with the penguins how much do you know about coach sullivan uh i know that he's been through it all and He's definitely going to bring uh, a lot to uh, the Wolfsburg team for sure. How about uh, having family around and be able to check out your games, that type of stuff? Uh, tell us about the support you get. Yeah, it's definitely special. I mean, not everybody gets to do that. Play at their uh, home rink, you could say. Live 15 minutes from it and be able to live at home and have all your family and friends that you grew up with uh, supporting you with definitely helps and makes a lot of fun. Patrick, being a forward in the American Hockey League, tell us about the, the talent and skill set that you need to do to be successful at this level. Uh, you got to be good at every part of the game and you got to be able to skate. Uh, all these guys at this level are they're right there. Some of them played in the NHL and every, it's, every day is just a battle to keep getting better and get to the next level. And Patrick, over the summer, talk about how much ice time you get in. Are you doing a lot of uh, you know dry land training, so to speak, and, and getting your, your body ready for the rigor? Yeah, I'm actually lucky. I get to train at uh, Cole Street with Joe Lorenz, training for Wilkes Bear, and I get to skate there. And I go away pretty soon to do uh, some power skating with a lady named Jackie Munzel. Well, Patrick, uh, we wish you well. Uh, glad you're uh, with the Wilkes-Barre Scranton Penguins, and I'm sure you're getting a nice hometown cheer here in Northeast PA coming up, all right? Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, that's Patrick McGrath signing with the Wilkes-Barre Scranton Penguins. We're ready for him here in Northeastern Pennsylvania. On the John Mandola Show, we are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers.